But if I recall, you do get to choose, if I remember correctly. Because I, if I recall, I made the wrong choice. Who was there? Was it the woodsman? Uh, I don't know. It's possible. Whoever it was. Well, I didn't make the best choice. I, happy to see him. Well, I feel like I'm gonna make the wrong choice too. Could use some help too. Well, where to first? Uh, we do get to choose when it comes up. I want to say so. You think he did it? What's her husband's name? So you said Toad? Yeah. Okay. Toad sounds like he needs help right now. We can check in on Prince Lawrence. Now, just so you know, we did see a bloody knife. Bye. Yeah, no. <laughs> That's why I'm choosing Toad. It sounds like whatever's going on with him is going on now, where the other guy's yeah. kind of dead. Yeah, the, my thought when I saw the bloody knife was great. He already yeah, killed himself. Well, he's here's the thing. Himself. Here's what you really should thought. He's a fable. He can survive an attempted suicide. Or an assault with a bloody knife. Yeah. We, we saw what happened to the huntsman. Yeah, but couldn't he have just cut his own head off and killed himself that way? Um, shit, sorry. <laughs> yeah, you're good. I'm sorry, I was listening to Zed. <laughs> and thinking about the different... Re it still seems like the bloody corpse would be there, though, when we get back. And we got a good look at the knife to the mirror, so it seems like Toad's thing is more shit. prominent, especially if he was going to be... Okay, okay, hold up. I know who was in that building. I saw that character model. Where did they go? <laughs> Yeah, I didn't recognize the character model, so... Well, you, you wouldn't. I, I, I did, because I know the game. Yeah, that's, you, that's why and, I know you, that. you wouldn't, so... It um, is a fable that you know, though. Whose apartment is this? Oh. Do, do this we have is the woodsman's. Okay. Probably get that gotcha. Fixed. And I'm did gonna they look... steal the kitchen sink? Well, no, that's where I smashed this head into it. <laughs> Remember, I beat the crap out. Yeah, of this remember, place. all this damage is from the fight. <laughs> all right. But I am looking around because I don't know if there's any, um... What kind of asshole swings a lamp at a guy? The same one that cut you open. And put stones in your belly and toss you in the river. He actually explained, um, how he actually got out of that situation. And how he had to swim, how he made it to a bank of the river... And how he had to shit out the rocks. Ouch. Yeah, no, he, he literally said it did not feel good. <laughs> I would imagine. Oh, yes, argument. You asked about um, Prince Charming. He is a character. He doesn't show up to the comic books. Told you, I think. Okay. I'll, I'll go into more detail as... Be nice in there, okay? Okay, I'll go into detail right now. Um, he's an asshole. Because he's Prince Charming. He, of course, looks gorgeous. And he's... But he doesn't have any money, essentially, when he came to, um, to New York. So he basically used his gorgeous, gorgeous looks to sleep with every woman he can, take all the money he can out of them, and then move on to the next. And he didn't just start doing this when he came to New York. He's been doing this since he's been in Fables. So he did that to... Every Prince Charming has been him. Anytime you see Prince Charming and they didn't name the prince, that's him. So he did that to Snow White. He did it to, I think, what was it? Sleeping Beauty. He, he did it to Cinderella. He did it to everyone. So he gets around. He gets around, and he's an asshole. Well, yeah, I mean, if someone gets around, they're usually an asshole. So, open the door, or just talk? Yeah, let's open the door. I gotta talk to a damn door. <laughs> I can do that here. I'll, I bet this one won't talk back as much. White. Surely you didn't come all this way just for my bother. Uh, why is he hiding a smaller toad? To admit, but, uh, I thought it was someone else in Woody's place. 
There was it though. Uh, not when I checked. Nothing but a leaky drain pipe. No, this is what his. Must have got the best of okay, so he's lying to us, uh, obviously. You know, false alarm. Sorry, I saw someone. X. Into this. There was someone, but they took off when we got here. Is that right? I guess your dad's ears have a year or two left. Haven't gone totally to the dogs, eh? Is that his son? He's fine yes. this way. Just stung his little toe. Better swimmer than Walker, just like his dad. Wanna? So, I guess you'll be taking off now. No need to hang around here anymore. I mean, I'm sorry you came all the way here for nothing. Uh, why? Someone was here, and something's going on. Just so this trip wasn't a complete waste of time, I'm gonna look around a bit before we leave, okay? Oh, he's clearly uncomfortable with that. Okay, so just stand over there and shut. Up. All right, all right. I just don't want to waste your time, is all. Now have a seat. So a he's covering for something. Up. Duh. Grown-ups, am I right? Uh. Hey, you know what? Flycatcher said you had a pretty awesome insect collection. I'd really love to see it. Is it in your room? It has a weevil. Cool. Again, it's so off-putting to see her nice right now. She's so cynical in this comic book. <laughs> nice. Which, based off the events of this game, make perfect sense. No, it will make flawless sense when you get to the end of this game. Gotcha. I don't know. Cynical Snail White? So I can kind of get behind. That oh. sounded way dirtier than I intended. No, <laughs> Augment, I, I, I'm going to say this. Yeah, yeah, because I I seen her in the comic books as well. Easily, I would date someone like her, right. even the cynical version of her. Yeah. Oh wait, I think there we go. Everything was plugged in, yet that lamp has a plug. Where was it plugged in? The lock. Looks like okay, someone kicked in his build in his room. Why is he trying to hide that? Well, what why the people usually hide things whenever something like this happens? True. So he clearly knows who did it, and he's being threatened. Obviously. Or are they still here? Blood, obviously. So, like that chimney. Can that hurt him? Because, you know, he fell down the chimney in his original story? Uh, well, basically, when I say it can hurt them, it... Oh! <laughs> okay, he's... Seriously? There's a bad liar, and then there's just laziness. The easy way to keep it simple, argument of what can kill and what can't. If the head get chopped off, they can get killed. And if they um, get hit by a magic weapon, they can be killed. Okay, I'll, I'll just stick with that. Uh, but, well, you're bringing up the story elements of what can kill them? Yes, to a degree. So it varies from person to person. Those are tiny claws. What, was he attacked by puss in boots? <laughs> He's actually a character in this, but not he doesn't show up in here. I was joking, but all right. So that legit could be a <laughs> thing. I think he actually shows up in the comic book. And a frog left claw marks. Really? Can we just threaten to eat him, please? He's gonna lie that poorly to us. The new Shaken Stevens album yet? If you're gonna say something, act with it. Um, why? But you wouldn't need keys. The lock's broken, so why'd you climb in through the window? Huh? Why'd you climb in through the window? You said it yourself. The lock's been rotten for weeks. You wouldn't have needed a key to get in. 
fucking hell. Just what are you on about, mate? After the state I was in, I didn't have me head, that's all it was. I forgot the fucking handle was fucking busted. And I'll tell you what else. It's embarrassing you bringing all this shit up, all right? So quit it with a third degree and all that. We're the sheriff. That's what we're supposed to do. He's so far a pretty good sheriff. And, okay, seriously, he didn't even bother. <laughs> yeah. Okay, can we threaten to eat him now, please? What of it? There's more blood on the tail. What of it? It's happened before or after you came in the window. After, after. Oh, I was I was poking the coals and it slipped a bit. Sliced up in my foot like a seashell. But You're not... Shit, <laughs> okay, sheriff. Can, now, please, what? can we... Please threaten to eat... Sorry. Why? You cut yourself? Didn't put the poker away after? Oh, I'm sorry, me housekeeping's not up to your standards. So, okay, come on. Can we look up the chimney? God, will you not make a big faff out of this? There's nothing to solve here, Sheriff. I'm telling you everything that happened. Why don't you believe me? I mean, things have been, you know. Why? I think maybe you're hiding something. Hiding something? Maybe. But, uh, to tell you the truth, I don't know yet. But I know you're lying about something. But I'm not... And you're just gonna make it worse for yourself the longer you keep up the act. I'm not bullshitting you. Honest. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the bull told it's not bullshitting us. Ugh. That's it? Um, That's all we get? Come on. We can't interrogate him a bit more? Um, yeah, I think we can talk to him, actually. Never been good with the feminine duties. Own body stuff with my clumsy hands. I want to say get tough, but let's be, let's go with B first. No, I know you're lying about the door. Fucking hell, Big B, I forgot my keys. Can't a grown frog just forget his latch for a bit? This wood might have rotted, but... Just made the kicking it in part easier. I know you, Toad. You sleep in your smashed up car's glove box before you think they're climbing the fucking window. I agree with that. Oof. Okay. Come clean, Toad. Yeah, let's go through them before yeah, we get yeah, tough. I wanna. They're the best for last. Just come clean. What's going on? The place needs a little brooming, that's all. Yeah, those blood spatters okay. are hard to get rid of. All right, get uh, off. Yeah. I know something's off here, Toad. And I know you know I can't leave until I find out why. So can we please just skip to the end of the page before I have to get mean? I don't know what you want, Big B. There's nothing going on. Okay, can we please threaten to eat them now? X. There's just, there's just nothing to tell. Look around the room and see for yourself. Everything has its explanation, you'll see. Honestly, Toad, I don't know if I will. And I don't know if I've got the patience to reverse engineer whatever scheme this is. You actually could. Come on now. We're friends, right? I mean, X. I called you here. I've gone down this road. Might as well keep going. You're gonna tell me right now what the fuck happened before we showed up. Maybe. I... It even has the faintest whiff of bullshit. I'm gonna... Dad. <laughs> Screw that. <laughs> you at least could have looked around or cringe and found something Damn. else that would go. Damn. <laughs> what is, it? is it hurt? He's hiding something. Either something he knows or something he's kept, but I won't play any more games with him. So I'll... wait, we could have looked around more? I thought we looked at everything. No, we could we could have um found something else that would have caused Oh, we could have did the right audio. Um, yeah. Bigby, you didn't. He didn't. <sighs> it was that butcher, a, a twiggle, a thumb of D. Okay, be more tactical. You well, no, just you, you can tell me to look around more because it is very possible I can miss something because I haven't played this game in months. Okay, I thought we'd seen everything. All right. Good enough. What else was there to see? Um, I. Oh, sorry, um, B. I don't actually remember. 
Uh, because I know there is a way to get him to tell you. Wait, did he just say Twiddle D did this to him? Yes. Oh, One of the Twiddles, D or Dumb. I did, but he said if word of this ever got back to him, if he ever thought you knew, or Miss White, he'd come back and kill my boy. I even tried to give the bastard a coat. He wouldn't take it. Whose coat? The girl. Dad borrows things from people who live here. Ha! Ah. Uh, sometimes. Borrows. I don't steal nothing. Good job, kid. Turn around here would astonish you, mate. We merely repossess what's been left behind. That makes uh, sense. We'll be taking the coat now. If she has next of kin, family, anyone. All right. Fetch him the fur. You know which coat is? Bit of dress it is. Her uh, donkey one, right? Yeah, that's what. And you invite Archimedes about the chimney. Yeah. That's why I went in front of the chimney. I was trying to see if I could legit interact oh, with the chimney. Yeah. In all seriousness, if I had said to look around, was there anything else? Could we have looked at the chimney? I No, I tried to look in the chimney, but I do believe, like... I think we had messed up on one of the audio cues with we messed up on the cue with the hot poker the uh, chimney poker um you said something it was um you should have chose something else and you would have made him have to come clean because you I think you would have said something like you don't have an injury on your foot injury on your foot or something like that was that a choice it, it wasn't a choice but I think one of the options would would it kind of badly but it would let you do that Oh, uh, okay. Now, do know that anything we do will progress the story. Yeah. Okay. Do you want to? Just maybe not in the way you want. That works. Man. Uh, I say why. Open it. Curious. I'm sorry, Faith. What could she have been sorry for? I don't know. I'm sorry, Faith. That's that's all. That's all we get, really. Well, it's been quite a surprising day. Okay, time to go see the probably dead Lawrence. See you out. <laughs> yeah, yeah, more than likely. <laughs> so is Mr. Toad pretty fragile? Because, you know, the Wisp of the Willows is not as well known of a story. Thanks. Uh, see ya. He's... He's immortal in the sense that he can live a long time. But, I mean, yeah. when um, I'm saying immortal and stuff... He's still a frog. So, he's not that strong. He's definitely not strong enough to kick in his own dough. Yeah. I'll be honest, Bigby. I don't really know how to feel about what happened in there. We got what we came for. Some information. So he ends up dating her. He ends up married to her. Wow. Well done, With Wolf. seven kids. So the <laughs> <laughs> All in one litter. Oh, God. oh yeah, I I think Zed, I got that chapter. Oh no! Remind me, <laughs> remind me, you bring it one day. Wow! Oh God! Yeah, that that I, that pregnancy. Woo! I can that only imagine that birth room scene. <laughs> woo! So oh God! They the just it was like a clown fun. call up in there. <laughs> oh God! <laughs> Why? We're here to question Lawrence. Bump him up on the suspect list, or cross him off entirely. Okay. Now, that being said, I just don't think he did it. You're gonna like who Big B's father is. For Mondays, maybe. Probably. Is yeah. Which one's Big B again? The wolf. Oh, Big B. Oh. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I, I, I lost for a second. I'm gonna end this part <laughs> real fast, just so that way I don't have a long part. <laughs> I'm hey. like